In this tutorial, we will learn two things by using VBA code. First is finding last used column in a particular row. Second, finding last used row in a particular column. So let's start with the first one. Let me go to developer tab. Here we have this insert option from ActiveX controls. I will select a command button and drag a command button here. Then I will right click on this, go to properties, change the caption. We can give name like last column. We can change the font and other properties as well. So let me make it bold and font size as 14. Now I'll close this property window and double click on this command button so that I will write VBA code that will be executed on the click event of this command button. On this data, we can see that we have data till column H and if we say by using first row, then last used column is column H and in numbers we can say column 8. So let's see what is the VBA code for this. I will double click on this command button and write the VBA code. So one variable I will take as last column equal to worksheets sheet name where we have data is sheet one dot cells here within bracket we need to specify row and column we know that we are looking for first row and column number we need to find out so we can say columns dot count bracket closed dot and then in brackets we will say excel to left that means from extreme right it will move towards left in column so this code will find the last used column and whatever is that number will store in variable named last column. So we are done with this code. Let's say what is that number. So we can publish here message box, MSG box within brackets. We will use the same variable that is last underscore column. Let me minimize this VB editor and see if this code is working. I will click on design mode to come out of design mode. Then if I click on this command button, we can see that we are getting value as 8. So this simple code will tell us which column is last used in a particular row. Now let's see what is the code to find last used row by using a specific column. So let me click on design mode. I can copy this command button as well or I can add new button. So I'll copy this. And then right click. Go to properties. Caption I can change to last row. I will double click on this command button and here we can write the code that will tell us which row is last in this data. We have very simple VBA code to find last used row. So let me take a variable last row equal to worksheets sheet name is sheet one dot cells now in this case we don't know the row number so we will say rows dot 
count and we are considering here first column so one dot and in brackets we will say excel up dot row so this is small vba code will generate the number of last used row and will store that number into this variable so let me write msg box and use the same variable let me minimize this vb editor and see how this code is working click on this design mode to come out of this design mode now i'll click on this last row we can see that it is giving us number as 16 and we can see in data we have 16 which is the last filled row by considering the first column so let let me show you the code again so this small code is very helpful while automating any report or working on any development project i hope this is helpful for you for any question related to this topic write into comments and subscribe to my channel for more learning tutorials